Mastering idiomatic expressions. A journey through preposition plus noun collocations. Hello, language learners. Today, we are going to delve deeper into the fascinating world of English collocations. Specifically, we'll focus on idiomatic preposition plus noun collocations, a vital part of understanding idiomatic expressions. Buckle up, and let's take your English to the next level. Idiomatic expressions are phrases or sayings that don't always follow standard grammar or syntax rules, and their meanings can't always be understood from the individual words. They add richness to language and are often culturally specific. A key part of idiomatic expressions is preposition plus noun collocations. These are pairs of words that frequently go together, forming a specific meaning when combined. For instance, in the phrase, he is in charge of the project, the words in and charge come together to form a meaning that transcends their individual definitions. Here, in charge of signifies responsibility or control over something. Let's dive into some common idiomatic preposition plus noun collocations. 1. In favor of. This means to support or approve of something. For example, she is in favor of the new law. 2. On purpose. This implies that something was done intentionally. For example, he didn't break the vase on purpose. 3. At risk of. This suggests exposure to danger or harm. For example, they are at risk of losing their home. 4. Under pressure. This indicates a state of stress due to demands or urgencies. For example, he is under pressure to finish the project. Remember, idiomatic expressions can't always be directly translated into other languages, so understanding and memorizing these collocations is crucial for fluency. Now, let's try to implement these collocations in everyday language. Practice making your own sentences using these collocations. My friend is in favor of veganism, so she only cooks vegan meals. I left my phone at home, but not on purpose. Due to climate change, many species are at risk of extinction. The team is under pressure to win the next match. The more you use these expressions, the more natural they will become. Well, that wraps up our journey through idiomatic preposition plus noun collocations for today. I hope you've learned something valuable that you can apply in your English conversations. Remember, learning a language is all about practice. So, keep practicing these collocations, and you'll see significant improvements in your fluency. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to seeing you in our next video.